Really extra. Can you guys guess where I am based on my friend's accent? Sabrina, come here. Hi. <laughs> guess where I'm from. You think if I turn the camera, they'll be able to guess where we are? Mm, yes, definitely. Okay. Well, you had your 30 seconds to guess. We are in beautiful Amsterdam. Poppy seeds, right? Poppy seeds, yeah. Poppy flowers. Poppy flowers. Because this is the poppy flower street. I was craving wine, but Sabrina suggested Cardinas, which are virgin Aperol spritz. And it's cocktails. You can't even tell. My mom ages. Okay, we just got back from shopping and I was tired so I took a nap and I'm getting Sabrina back into bullet journaling. We're doing our August spreads right now. And now we're gonna have dinner at a wine bar that Sabrina used to work at. Tapping Two beer. Two fingers, tapping beer. <laughs> okay, on the way to dinner. Second workout. Yeah. We've been very, what have we been doing the past couple hours? Repeat, like, workout, chill, repeat. A bullet journal. I picked up this outfit yesterday while we were uh, vintage shopping because, you know, I was working out. Every uh, outfit is an upgrade. I've been um, translating my very LA days to Sabrina. We're being very healthy people. Oh, today's also pride, so it's gonna be crazy. Okay, fine. Glitter. All right. Do you want on the outside? Fun. Going to pride. back I am not naked it was so stimulating immediately crashed into a nap it's actually quite cool the city because everything's so close but everything's surrounded by water and I have no idea how to get around or where I'm going because I'm just literally following Sabrina and I found this at the grocery store nearby this has to be the best milk I've ever tried this actually tastes like real milk unlike all the almond milks and stuff that um, I see in stores have so much preservatives and sugar and additives in it. I don't trust it, I don't drink it, I make my own. But this one only has water, coconut cream, Himalayan salt, ground rice, cashews, and nutritional yeast. It tastes like real milk. I think the nutritional yeast really does something. So I'm really excited to try to make this at home. Enjoy my afternoon coffee. I also find it so much easier to film like this when I'm alone. Sabrina went to get her nails done and I'm just doing our laundry. I quite like the European way of just hanging it. I really think I'm gonna get one of these at home. So much easier. I did all the laundry, I made myself coffee, I hung out, I was on my laptop. I'm basically making myself really at home here. I didn't realize that there was like really good thrifting here more vintage shopping, but it's really well priced. And Sabrina's lived here for like 11 years. So how are you not freaking out over, oh, she's home. Things have gotten wild. Really? Like every street is blocked around here. Um, I was just gonna show them the, the that we bought the same shirt. Okay, no, this is the thing. No. I was right in the middle of telling the story how I'm here and I'm like freaking out over the silk shirts here, 100% silk very nice worn in and then sabrina goes 
oh yeah it's okay just, i don't know if i have bad taste because she has such good taste i just bought so many things recently that i didn't think you needed anything i needed anything exactly well when do you not need a silk shirt and it was at like episodes which is a yeah what is it like a very common vintage store here <laughs> she takes me to like a more curated shop one of the cutest vintage stores i've ever been to very well priced as well she picks up the shirt she goes this is cute right 30 dollars. it's like double the price of mine <laughs> and then we get home and we try on our stuff and i'm like wait we have it's exactly the same color <laughs> one gold and then two gold on that side i like it well same store i found these cool karate pants these are my new summer pants forever. Oh, and at the same store I got this, $5. There was a $10 bin, okay? And I found this, just a white shirt. And it was one of those things where you're working out and you're wearing like nothing cute and you put clothes on, you're like, this looks way better. So of course you end up buying it. White, crisp, comfy, loose, worn in. This, I wasn't sure about. I still have no idea how to wear it. I think it would look really cute with like a cute dress like a sweetheart dress. Okay, lastly, this is also at episodes. I got this like little antique baby doll dress. Maybe I should just wear this out, back out. Fringe scarf? Yes, very cute. So it's glad 20? you got that. 20. This is our pride right now. Good morning. I'm gonna make Sabrina some breakfast. Avocado toast on sweet potato and a mushroom omelet. Dig in. Dig in. Play it up to the camera. Mm. Oh, yeah? Mm. <laughs> mm. It is a beautiful, beautiful day out. I really like can see myself living here, but I know Amsterdam is usually a cold place. Sabrina's out of facial. So that means we are just gonna do some skincare. We've been taking it really chill which I think surprises Sabrina because she's not used to like her friends coming to Amsterdam and wanting to just like take it easy. Every time I start vlogging, she comes back. Your face looks so good. Right? Yeah. Got it. Very cute. Also, how good is my skin right now? She also said I have rosacea right here, and then she managed to get rid of it. I'm here for fashion week, but I thought I would just enjoy myself in Europe, share with you guys a little bit of Copenhagen fashion week, which already seems 10 times more chill. I've also managed to live out of that one little suitcase for two weeks, so I'm impressed with myself. But I think the trick to packing for long periods of time in a little carry-on is to just have good building pieces. Lots of little accessories and scarves. And you guys know that everywhere I go, I like to immediately make myself at home. So I got coffee and... This is my second Morty and me, Roxanne here. <laughs> Very active member. We're getting pasta. Okay, so I can open it right yeah. now. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. First day of fashion week. Some coffee. Some food. So I don't really have many outfit options. I'm wearing my little Isabelle skirt. My pink toopy toppy. I'm gonna wear this jacket over. Made the camp. You probably 
don't remember, but that's so okay. Okay, first show out of the way. We're heading to see Francis again. She leaves today, so sad. I'm gonna change outfits. I'm gonna do that thing to have another outfit waiting at her hotel. It's also such a per perfect day out. Tessellated tiles, less falls, leave the path. Wandering through Everything in um, Copenhagen is pretty walkable. I'm gonna walk for 40 minutes to my next show and hopefully get to see some things. This is what I look like right now. Wandering through the days of So I think I have a bit of a break. I have one presentation later. Not that these things are any bit important. Everyone seems to have gone off to lunch. With everyone from press. I'm gonna have lunch by myself. If I didn't have my little solo road trip, I would have felt a lot more um, bad about myself maybe. But I feel quite okay about it. I say quite because I'm like, Oh, wait, do I need to be having lunch with somebody? Maybe it's all fashion week where everyone's just like, I'm doing this, I'm doing that, and you're like, not comparing yourself, but you kind of can't help it sometimes. Going back to my apartment, I'm very excited about that. Roxanne from yesterday told me that this place is really good called Blue Taco, and I love Blue Flower. I saw someone make it on YouTube where they said that hibiscus, even though it's a flower, kind of has a meaty texture to it. And it does. And I really wanted to try it, so I'm surprised it's here. Okay, I just woke up from like an hour nap. I have one presentation. I get to take the stress out, see how it looks. Let's touch up the face a little bit. Some lip balm. Why do I look so tired? Ugh, 30. I don't know, I can't tell. Does it need a skirt? Maybe I'll just do lobster halter top. I like what's happening. My third look of the day. Today or? Um, yesterday. yesterday. Yeah. Fingers crossed for the winner. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I got my outfit. I'm very excited about it. I actually think it's one of my favorite outfits I've worn in a while. I just feel like watching the clouds go by now. Just hanging out with my Balenciaga jacket. Very chill. I don't really know that many people here, so hanging out by my lonesome. Let's see how much I've walked today. 7.1 miles, 1,600 steps. When I'm in LA, it's like 1,000, 2,000 steps. <laughs> or I guess when I was in Montana, I didn't walk that much either. Yeah, we could have done a few. A little wardy in here. Oh, yes! Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Good morning. Oh, I already got ready. The sun's coming out, so I actually might be able to get away with liming there. This is the outfit I picked up from the showroom yesterday that we were in for like a hot minute. I'm really bad at pronouncing these these Danish names. We've been calling it Bomb. Bomb and Perf Dog? Lost in translation is my bus.
ended up in Chini Park's um, her party bus. <laughs> I think of the satisfaction of feeling these things pop Can under you my feel it? Yes, do you not? It's like are you watching the Ghani show, Simon? Oh, it's thriving! I missed the Ghani show on purpose, so I can have nachos while everyone's out there in the rain. Last show! outfit all day but I think it was a hit tonight's my last night I'm gonna go out to dinner with this brand bomb and Piff garden I can't say it right and I would wear this but I feel like I've been in it all day so slick my hair back maybe put some red lipstick on and uh... <laughs> Thank you. 